The Roseau girls basketball team is coming off their second straight trip to state and a third place title a season ago. And with a more majority of their roster returning, they're eyeing even bigger goals. Our goal is to win state. Coming off two straight Class 2A state tournament appearances, there's no denying the Rams' confidence is high. But they still aren't satisfied after falling short of their goal of a state title a year ago. Knowing that we were within like eight points of the first place team and that we should have been in the championship game, I think it's really going to push us to work even harder. They know they'll be playing with an X on their back this season. It's, it puts a lot of pressure on us, but it's also really motivating to know that people respect us and respect how well our team plays. Teams definitely come with their best game, you know, when we come to town or when they come to our gym. But I just feel like we're composed, we're confident, we're mature. And I think we're seeing the rewards of that now where they just they just seem like veterans. But they are a veteran group returning all but two players from a season ago, including the state's fourth leading scorer, Kylie Barovich, who averaged just over 26 points per game for the Rams last year. Well, we want her going to the basket and looking to attack the rim and, and score off layups or getting herself to the free throw line, drawing falls, things like that. And if that's not there, looking to kick. And then the options are really unlimited, whether it's Ivy or Halsty for a three, out to one of her sisters, you know, for a three or an attack, or dumping it to one of our posts down low. We just, we have weapons all over the place. And with those weapons, they believe this is the team to bring home a state title. I think they're very, very driven and motivated. And, and like I said, I think just now have the maturity and the poise and the experience to, um, to make that happen. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.